In this example, we're going to examine uh, methods uh, for uh, enhancing kind of two, two challenging situations at once, and that is enhancing a license plate uh, that is in a low light or, or dark situation. Uh, so we're going to uh, zoom in to the license plate. Here we can kind of barely make it out here in the image, but we're going to go ahead and zoom in to that area that we want to enhance, which is the, the license plate in this vehicle. And we can just kind of make out uh, the edges of the license plate and kind of tell that something is there, but it's not really clear. Uh, the next step is we uh, do in most cases where we're just focusing on a particular area of the video is we're going to select a region of interest. And we're going to find our enhancements and select our region of interest tool. We're just going to redraw this box, move it around, resize it. Again, we're just focused on enhancing uh, this portion of the video. We're not concerned with enhancing other things at this point. So our region of interest will uh, confine our enhancements just to this area of the video. We're going to start off with using our resolution filter, which we do in many cases. And you can see that's already kind of clearing up some of that. We'll see a little bit more as we make some other adjustments. But basically, we're, we're sampling 51 frames of video. We're looking at the current frame plus 25 frames that have already occurred and 25 frames that have yet to occur. And that makes up our 51 frame sample. And you can already see, we can already start to make out the first two letters. Looks, looks, looks like an N and a P, and we can see some other outlines of some other uh, characters in this license plate. We're going to look at some other filters first, and we'll come back up to our resolution filter. We're going to look at our contrast filter. You can see that makes the, uh, some of these characters pop a little bit more, and our light and color filter. And this is just using some default settings. We're going to make a couple of uh, adjustments to the contrast filter, we're going to bump this up a little bit and uh, increase the level a little bit, and give it a little bit extra pop. And then we're going to, uh, in our light and color filter, we're going to disable the, the auto levels and just turn this down a little bit. It's really bright um, where the background of the license plate is. Now we're going to go back up to our resolution filter. And we're going to, uh, again, we're going to max out our frames here to 51. And we're going to max out our super resolution factor all the way up to a factor of four, get a little bit of additional clarity. And then as a the last step, we're going to um, enable our fusion parameter. And you can see we're starting to make out some more of these characters here. It looks like an N and a P possibly a three or an eight, a zero, a nine, a six, a two, and maybe another nine. We're going to uh, utilize our accuracy slider here and see if we can get some more of these edges here. And you can see it kind of helps a little bit in seeing some of these other edges here. So maybe we'll apply just a little bit of that as well. And make one final adjustment here in our contrast section, and that really kind of makes these uh, these characters pop. We may want to look at using our sharpening filter as well as our deblurring filter, and that actually helps quite a bit uh, in seeing some of these characters a little bit more. And we can go back up, maybe try taking out our accuracy slider a little bit. And again, we've got a pretty pretty good idea, at least a, a pretty good partial on this license plate example here. And we can quickly compare it with the original where we can't really even see anything. And now we've got a pretty strong partial that we can use. And so now we can go to our products area and we can take a snapshot of this picture. And we just right click on our uh, enhanced product that we've created, this snapshot, click Save As, and specify our save location. And again, with just a couple of minutes time and, and a couple of filters here, uh, we've gone from a very dark, hard to make out uh, uh, license plate, and we have a very uh, strong partial here that we're able to take an enhanced snapshot of and uh, save out of Ikea Forensic.